Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel. My name is Isabel from the TarotEmpress.com. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I'm going to be doing your tarot card reading now. It is going to be focused on your love life. Please note that there is going to be an extended reading. You can find the link in the description box below. If you want a personal reading, you can get it at the TarotEmpress.com. Okay, so what I see is that there's a great deal of heartbreak and pain that is happening between you and a certain person, okay? I'm going to be looking at the energies more closely. Let's clarify these cards. I see a relationship right that came to an end I can clearly see that this might have been a marriage it might have been in just you dating somebody and you see that sort of energy coming to an end and it makes you feel a sense of sadness you are essentially hurting because something or someone was lost during the situation I'm also picking up that you know, for some of you, there's this energy of perhaps choices, but not necessarily have to be always that case. It can also be indicating, you know, a strong love connection or perhaps, you know, someone was fooling around. Doesn't have to always be the case. So I am sensing that something has come to an end. Could be that some of you are going through a divorce or, you know, um, went through a breakup or the end of a relationship. It made you feel a sense of sadness. Let's look at the next energies. So... For the person that you're dealing with, I feel like, you know, they've lost their sense of peace. They've lost their sense of happiness. They don't, you know, when it comes to their passions, I feel like they feel very frustrated in respect of the situation. So there is that sort of energy, you know, where this individual doesn't know what to do with regard to this heartbreak, this pain, this sadness. Everything just fell apart. They feel stressed out. They don't know how to deal with it. It feels as if they're trying to keep everything together, right? So the person you're dealing with is struggling to keep things together in terms of their energies. I'm sensing from the cards that attempts to come back together or attempts to work things out through communication, it never yields a lot of positive results. It didn't bring those sort of results that you were hoping for it to bring. It Instead, you know, there was just this feeling of regret, sadness and loss. And then when the two of you were actually apart, you know, there was feelings of emptiness and loss and uh, feelings of neglect. So... Any attempts to get back together may have felt as if, yes, there's a genuine chance to work things out. The two of you will communicate and talk, 
but I feel like the two of you got nowhere in doing so. And this might have been even more frustrating, even more uh, challenging, especially for the two of you, right? Okay, so what I'm seeing is that this individual, you know, they were trying to be as methodical as possible, planning out how they would communicate to you and how things would go in terms of their mind. They saw a different situation than what actually played out. So going back to the last conversation or a handful of conversations that you had with this individual, what they planned didn't really happen, you know. What they wanted was not really achieved. I'm picking up the energy of uh, conflict and uh, difficult sort of energies. I feel like in terms of the two of you getting back together, there was this element of toxicity, right? There's also this energy of temptation that's coming in. Temptation from outside sources. Or perhaps you felt as if uh, you couldn't really trust what this individual was doing in their perspective, you know. They might have seen or thought that you were going after other individuals. Someone was feeling jealous here, okay. It can either be that you were doing things that, were, that was making this individual feel jealous or they were doing things to make you feel jealous, right. And I feel like there was a desire and an impatience to fight off these other challenges or suitors that were trying to come into the picture and that was making things even more difficult. And I feel like someone gave up and said that they don't want to fight anymore. And, uh, you know, someone called it quits. That's what I'm picking up. And there's a lot of grief, emotional grief as well, as a result of this. Feels like a lot of pettiness, but a lot of decisions that were made in haste and things that didn't really um, provide much uh, reward at the end of the day. Because I feel like the two of you were going around in circles, perhaps even trying to trigger each other off in terms of the behaviors and energies. I feel like someone was being selfish here, not thinking of the other individual's needs. Selfish in communication or perhaps very secretive when it comes to uh, their feelings and, and what they were going through. And I feel like there was a lot of conflict. There's also an indication that, um, you know, whenever there was an opportunity to work things out or rebuild things up or whenever, you know, there was this sort of um, thing that was allowing for the two of you to come together. It always ended up uh, very shattered. Like it just didn't work out like the way you wanted it to. It didn't work out like the way they wanted it to. It was just causing and resulting heartbreak, pain and sadness and emptiness. And this was uh, a lot of turmoil. And I feel like for you, you know, it was hard to hold on to the situation because it felt as if you were going around in circles and, you know, you wasn't achieving anything as a result of this. And it got very frustrating as time went along. So for this individual, everything is sort of collapsing around them, right? 
I feel like things are literally falling apart. I'm seeing cards which are indicating lots of pain, lots of sadness, right? They feel shattered because things fell apart and things didn't work out like the way they wanted it to. So I'm going to be exploring the balance of these cards on an extended reading. You can find the links in the description box below. If you want to post the reading, you can get it at thetarotempress.com. Have a wonderful day and take care.